Ow. Alright, fine. Put on the mask. I guess it will trivialize a lot of things. Pretty sure roamers are fine to kill. I've got bullets to spare. Why are you carrying around a butter knife? I mean, you will have to leave at some point. I didn't see any water, nor any place to grow food. That one's hostile to me now. Well, at least it's not the stupid, ridiculous one that they do with the, uh, the radioactive grenades. Got him. Another one. Guys, don't you see how friendly I am? Boom. Headshot. Well, not a headshot. Because this thing shotguns too much, but whatever. Hopefully by now, I've uh, dealt with all the ones who learned of my little indiscretion. That's the way it wants me to go. So this is the way I will go. Uh, I need more rads. Or rad resistance, rather. Somebody's definitely here. How about up? I do not want to rearm the bear trap. That sounds like a good way to cripple myself. Good job, me. Good job. Alright, so that's the way to go, I suppose. That's the way out. Still haven't found whoever lives or lived here. I've been here, from the other direction. I can sell you things. 
Hey. Um. That's a weird outfit. What do you need? Nope. Yep, thanks for not much. Alright. Out the way they tell me. I am over encumbered. I am in combat. We'll explore this place later. Hmm. This is another shop. Nope. Okay. Okay, that was fine. Dude, this is... This is great. Oh, sorry. Lady. Madam. Out. I want all your stuff, though. Alright, fine. Hey there. Thanks. Alright, you take care of yourself, lady. Sorry I took your grenades. What's hiding behind here? Probably nothing relevant. Well, I can't disarm that because I don't have an explosive skill of 60. Um thinking about blowing it up, but maybe I come through here again and don't blow it up? Yeah, I'm not starting a fight here. I'm not starting a fight I don't need to fight. That's... That's nice. I'll have to check that out later. Hmm. Nothing? So frustrated with you, dog. Still nothing? Yep, still nothing. Dog, I swear to god, if you get home. So, mutants bring people down here once they've captured them. And there's a mutant right there. Super attentive. Always vigilant. That's what they call me. Maximum perception. I see all the subtle clues. All of them.
Ooh, big guy. I feel like I need to put some more into my guns. I got too much sway here. in that other room. Most likely foe, but possibly friend. Got him. Yeah, definitely foe. Ah, there you are. Dude, come on. I mean, there wasn't much what with you having just a sledgehammer, but come on. Uh, there are better sniper rifles out there. I should go get one. So this is the way it wants me to go. So let's take a look at this side hallway. Looks empty. Oh, hidden stash note. What does that say? JP is a li lying, toilet sucking, good for nothing, rain. A rad-brained bastard. The stash doesn't exist. We searched everywhere down here. Nothing. Not one lousy gun. We managed to pick up some ammo, but that's about it. Now we're stuck here with these mutants. Streaming in. And out of the tunnels. What are those bastards even doing? A snuck. Some of our supplies at the end of the southeast tunnel. Under debris. There's no way we can sneak past the bastards. Carrying it all out by ourselves. Alright, so southeast... Right. So the other way. But just because they couldn't find it doesn't mean it doesn't exist. I do need some thirst and some hunger. Oh wow, that's a lot of stuff. That's a lot, a lot of stuff. Alright, right, fine. Okay, needs are tended to. Nothing down here. Alright, let's go around the other side. Fortunately, this isn't going to dump me out into like a billion different places. Yo, hey, Malk. I saw you lurking there for a while. Busy day. Nothing down in here. Mask, 
come on. Did something sneak behind me and start shooting my dog? Yeah, it did. <laughs> Don't mess with a heavily armored lady and a fire sword. Now we just need to make our way to the ranger compound. Ah, oh, the town company are fighting with mutants. I think I will let them do that. It's a little bit ridiculous that the IT director's account's getting locked out there, Malk, yeah. It's uh it's kind of a mess. Where does it want me to go here? Just straight east? What is over here? It's wide open. So many 308 rounds. I love it. Absolutely love it. Alright, so before we run off this way, I want to see what's over here. This looks wide open. Knowing my luck, it'll be a behemoth or something. It must just be the edge of the map, maybe. Lying congressional style. And pile of money. That's absolutely perfect. Oh, wow. Yeah, I think we'll just leave them to it. Let's just uh, sneak away quietly, shall we? Doopy doopy doop 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 doop. Don't pay any attention to me. Y'all can do your fighting. People of the Capital Wasteland, it is I, Three Dog, your ruler. Hear me and obey. Oh, sorry, that's that other radio station. You're listening to the adventures of me, oh, Herbert perfect Danny timing. Dashwood, and my stalwart ghoul manservant, Argyle. Today's episode, In the Black Widow's Web. Well, those super mutants are persistent, if nothing else. A word of advice, keep running! 
In those hills up there. Isn't that where the hidden village of Rakopolis is located? If only we knew where it was. Turns out you're in good company, Miss Chase. Argyle and I are old friends of Rakopolis. Know the secret knock and everything. Boss, that's privileged information. You can't just... Now, now, old chum. Miss Chase is hardly going to violate the secrets of Rakopolis. Isn't that right, Miss Chase? Besides, necessity calls. So you do know where it is. Well, come on, then. Those super mutants can't be far behind. Just over here, this large boulder. And now, the secret knock. Move and a boulder and a secret voila. knock. Brilliant. Now that's what I call a getaway, Terry. So tell me, do you take all your girlfriends here? Oh, no, Miss Chase. I can assure you this will be our special place. Listen to yourself, boss. This is Rakopolis, one of the safest places in the wasteland, and you just showed a stranger where it is. Ignore my manservant's muttering, Penelope. He has Daring a is such an idiot. Dramatic, you see. Why, one time... Oh, I don't know, Daring, darling. I find the ghoul's instincts to be frighteningly accurate. Here I thought we were friends, and now you have a gun in my face. Bad form, Miss Chase, bad form. Jabber all you want. In about 30 seconds, my associates from Paradise Falls will join us. I knew it. I knew this dame was no good. But it's worse than I thought. She's the Black Widow, the leader of the slavers. The Black Widow. Right, right. We've been trying to capture these Rakopolis rodents for years. Never could have done it without you, Daring. Looks like I've gotten this into one heck of a pickle, Argyle, old chum. One heck of a pickle, indeed. Be sure and tune in next time for another exciting adventure of me, Herbert, Herbert Daring, Daring Dashwood. Dashwood, and my stalwart ghoul manservant, Argyle. And now, some music. Thank you for the donations, Magical. There's something I'm supposed to read here. Notice from Canterbury Search Party. Bad news. Rangers haven't seen Cheryl and got troubles of their own. Mutie's been snatching up people left and right. Riley's men are going to keep an eye out around here. They suggested we head to the western ruins across the river and search for it there. I guess that's what you do. Why couldn't you just wait for us? Search party log number two. To see you. Hey, Brick. You you are excitable. I hear water in pipes. Well, there's Riley working on a lawnmower. Give me a status report. Hey, all right. Hey, good. Everybody made it. Awesome. Hey, Butcher. Welcome back. It's great to see you again. Oh, really? So you hey, Donovan. You sure know your shit. Ever consider joining the Rangers? I bet Riley would love to have you on our team. I can't talk to you? That's so dumb. Alright, fine. Riley first. You look like you've been through hell. You look like you should stand up. It was all on day's work. It was all in today's work. I only had one one tricky part. You're a cocky little thing, aren't you? I like that. Well, as much as I want to hear all about it, can you tell me a full debrief on what happened out there with my man? Uh, before we talk about that, do you have my reward? Uh, it actually, it went really well. No one, no one died. I'm very impressed at your skill. I don't think I've come across someone quite like you in the ruins. I suppose I owe you a debt. And I intend to pay it in kind. I'm sure you're more interested in your reward than listening to me talk. So let me get right to it. Uh... No, please continue? Losing a bit of the murk edge, eh? Don't get soft on me now. Well, I've said it once, but I'll say it again. You have my thanks. I'd be pretty lost without my guys. So... For your reward, what'll it be? 
the Ranger battle armor or one of Brick's miniguns? Well, you got anything else? Sorry, we need every piece of equipment we've got. I can spare the gun and the armor, but that's about it. Well, I always take the combat armor every time I've ever played this, but I've also gone for a light armor build, not a power armor build. So I think the minigun is more my speed. You got it. Use it well, and take down some more muties with it for us. Consider this place your home away from home. If you're ever in the neighborhood again, you're more than welcome to take shelter here. I guess that does it. See you around, kid. What's the deal with the town company? I mean, they were just picking a fight with the mutants twice. Let me give you a word of advice. Stay away from them. They give Mercs a bad name. They have no morals, no remorse, and wouldn't hesitate to put a bullet through a defenseless man's head if it meant a job. They've been pretty active lately around the old Capitol building ruins. I'd recommend giving that area a wide berth. Have you had run-ins with them? Yeah, we've crossed paths. Fortunately, we just stepped out of each other's way. Brick almost turned it into a damn bloodbath when one of them spit on her boots. But I was able to hold her back. What's been happening since you've been back? I don't know. I'm not sure I'm cut out for this kind of job anymore. I almost got everyone killed in Vernon Square. What kind of a responsible leader does that? It was one bad decision after another. We all make mistakes. You're not a fortune teller. You can't reload your saves in life. Yeah, but I led the guys right into a corner. Theo died because I decided to take shelter in the hospital. I'm not so sure I'd be trusted leading anyone at this point. I mean, he, he was not wearing armor. It's a tremendous risk to do what you do. Thanks. It's nice of you to try and make me feel better about everything. I just hope that I can get back to mapping the ruins soon. I have a lot of contacts that are demanding I finish. Let me help you. You'd risk your neck for me like that? I'd expect to be paid a Merc's wage. Eh, well, it actually looks like you need the help. Well, okay. I hadn't expected this, but I'll certainly take you up on it. Oh, and I insist on paying you. I won't take no for an answer. For every map marker you uncover in the Capital Wasteland, I'll pay you a fair sum in bottle caps. All you have to do is find them. Come back here and I'll get them off your Pip-Boy there. Yeah, okay. Here, take this geomapper. Please don't lose it. Donovan spent a year developing it and I only have a few. It will offload all the map data you collect from your Pip-Boy automatically. When you come back, I can take the data from it, and you get paid. Let's see how Eugene looks. Let's go ahead and put on... Actually, let's go ham with Mentats as well. And then we'll go ahead and bind it. Looking good. 79 damage. Hmm. Not quite as good as a Gatling laser. But 5 millimeters are way easier to come by. And... Yes. Lying congressional style. I got the look. I got the upgrade from it. Need some uh gonna need some heavy gun skill now. What do I need to get to that? Sixty. Okay. Alright. Do I have a new item for it? The Geomapper? Geomapper module. So I have to carry it. Can hey you pay there. me what I have already? Got anything good for me? I have some mapping data for you. Hmm. You need to actually collect some new data before I can pay you. 
We already have all these locations in the system. Well, I've been feeling a little more confident now that I have you mapping for us. I think we'll head out into the ruins and do some search and destroy to ease back into things. Dang. Uh-oh, you're back. Something need fixing? Sure. I think we can do something about that. Oh god, 11 repair skill? No thanks. Uh, what's it been happening since you've been back? Oh wow, well... Riley snapped out of a slump now that you're mapping for the rangers. Now we go out and kick ass like the old days. Hoorah! Cool beans. See you again. It's unlikely I'm coming back here for caps, though. You made it. Great. Need patching up? Sure. Yeah, you look like you need some work. But for God's sake, don't go waving the white flag. We'll just strangle you with it. And now, some music. You made it. Great. Things seem better now. Riley's gained back her confidence a bit. We've been doing stuff here and there. I don't know what you said to her, but thanks. Have a good one. Hey, Brick. Well, all right, you're back. Now that you're part of the team, Riley's her old self again. We've been vaporizing hostiles like there's no tomorrow. I like you, Brick. I like you. Still thinks he's active. Alright. Well, let's head out and then figure out our next point of attack. Okay, so... Listen to the radio signal. I'm already downtown here. I guess I could go to the National Archives. What's my carry capacity look like? Oh god, 99%? Alright, change of plans. We aren't going downtown. Uh, we are going back to Tenpenny Tower. And then I guess we head into the pit? On my way, I'll stop by the outcasts and see what they'll give me for all my scraps. How much do I have now? Holy cow, that's a lot of bullets. Dog is picking a fight with something. Hey, dog. Stop that. Okay, much better. Alright, let's save and see if we can check this out. This is dedicated to my old friend, Crazy Wolf Dog. No one can scour the wasteland and find Alright, let's see if they are mad if I go inside. I should be a friend of the outcasts. Let's check out their fort here. Expect to see more outcasts inside. Oh, 
All right, nobody's mad at me yet. Looking good. Stealth boy. Very nice. Don't push your luck out here. Okay, we'll uh we'll we'll let you do your thing here. Oh. That door tricked me. Field reports. Data log protector Kazdan. Ah. audio records. They actually recorded them. That's kind of cool. Might as well take these and turn them into more bullets, right? Oh, that's broken terminal. Never mind. Hmm. Boo. Also boo. Good to see you. Good to see me. That's what I like to hear. Nothing quite like not getting into a fight with people. Ah yes, stealth boys. So nice. More stealth boys. I want to say that they'll take fission batteries too. Stealth boy. So many stealth boys. And that is a quantum off in the corner. Perfect, perfect. Defender Rock Fowl. And Defender Morgan. Good of you two to actually take naps. I bet you don't have unique dialogue, though. That's disappointing. Uh, you get hopeful, but it doesn't really always pan out. Hope is a hell of a drug. What's the map look like inside here? Not much. Ooh, that's an actual Nuka Cola. Oh. First, not a secret room, not a storage closet. Second, Nothing special at all about the toilet. They, uh, they set up a nice little camp in here, but there don't seem to be many of them. Then again, I have seen an awful lot of patrols, especially north of the ruins. I guess most people would consider it, like, you're supposed to fight them or something, they're supposed to be evil, you're supposed to just love the regular brotherhood. Don't get me wrong. I love the Brotherhood in this game. But I also really enjoy the Outcasts. I feel like the Outcasts do a better job of representing the Brotherhood after Maxon than the Mojave chapter does. Independence terminal password. Identity verification. Antibacterial spray. 
Well now, what was this for? Currently, it seems to be nothing more than a storage facility. Hmm. There's got to be cool stuff down here, right? Don't push your luck out here. Broken terminal. Oh. Yeah, 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 whatever. I'm just knocking over little things. No big deal. Don't don't have a cow, man. Good to see you're holding up all right. Further down. Oh wait, no. No, I'll take that book. I don't think I'm likely to go over to the library, but, you know, whatever. Fort Independence Storage Key. I was not wearing my armor. Research Terminal. Analysis. Further research regarding laser weaponry has not revealed much we didn't already know. A small production run of prototype weapons built by the U.S. military. Most of these weapons were recovered from military authorities, where the weapons were being tested for live fire groups with active duty personnel. Power drawn from microfusion cell is processed through a wave particle diverter, precision cut lenses, optic energy. Hmm. Replaced with clear gas, but require a great deal of skill to fabricate, so they can't make more. Field operation. Fully charged cell will discharge 20 bolts from a pistol and 12 shots from a rifle model. Recoil is negligible compared to ballistic weapons, so long range combat requires less marksmanship. Chassis are easily opened, allowing the weapon to be serviced. In the field, purified water and a clean cloth can be used to wash mirrored glass components. This is a lot of detail. I like this. It's really nice. Now, let's see if any of these change. Plasma rifle. The plasma rifle, like the laser rifle, uses microfusion cell. Uses its power supply, it taps into the cell, essentially. A small fusion reactor, a typical microfusion cell, can supply the rifle with around eight shots. Hmm. Don't push your luck out here. Minigun. Why am I researching such old technology? Practice, practice, practice. Blah blah blah. Anyway, the minigun uses much smaller round than most of the rifles found throughout the waste. However, the rate of fire on the minigun makes up for the small 5mm sending a hail of bullets toward its targets. Its sheer size, coupled with the trademark sound, is enough to send anyone in the path running for cover. It's a great weapon for suppressing fire, letting others flank the unsuspecting enemy. A typical cartridge holds around 100 rounds. These numbers are off. And my throat is raw. Captain said you're clear. Missile launcher. After several attempts to modify the missile launcher to increase its accuracy, I conclude it cannot be done. In fact, this is the third one I've broken in the past month. I will pass the task to LJ Rogers. Oh, little J. He seems confident that it can be modified, that I merely overlooked the obvious miscalculations. Technically, the missile launcher I have recently worked on is not broken, it just does not function properly. A 
Enclave Armor. After several radiation experiments, I can safely conclude that the Enclave Armor is more radiation resistant than Power Armor. Although not by much. Regardless, the research and the tests are needed to determine exactly what makes it more resistant. Hmm. Pulse Grenade. The Pulse Grenade is the most effective weapon against robotics. Upon detonation, an intense electromagnetic pulse is emitted, severely crippling robotics. Within the expulsion radius, they are extremely handy against many of the robots and turrets found throughout the capital wasteland. Ooh, minigun. And the missile launcher that doesn't work. Alien power cells? Plasma rifle, microfusion cells. Howdy, Hollywood. Welcome by. The outcasts are uh, happy with us right now, so we're just taking a look at their fort. Hmm. Alright, a little bit of junk out of the way. Good to see you're holding up all right. Nope. No bottle cap mine for me. Well, except for the one that was right there. Never mind. There are so many things to look at here. Mm, I am happy with that stealth boy. Mm. Oh my god, so many stealth boys. I'm gonna have to start using them, I guess. Hey, Kasdan, take all that stuff I looted from your base. Alright, let's head back to home base and then fetch some caravans back north and make our way to the pit. Looks like a power station, maybe? Just north of the Robco facility. And that's a Yaogwai, right? Yep. Oh, wait, hold on. What are you picking a fight with? Oh. Alright, Yagwai. Come on, mod. There we go. Oh, well, I got him. Take that. Yagua came in and just ate a bunch of raiders, I guess. Oh, I didn't even see what the place is named. Hold on. We'll figure that out once I uh, loot all this stuff. Look at all this junk. And a mini nuke. Nice. So what is this place called? 
Vapple, Vapple 84 power station. Anything relevant? Shoot. I don't know why that was friendly, but we aren't bothering with that, that's for sure. That is not a thing we risk here. Alright, Tenpenny. Home sweet home. 